best and the worst. One of my favorite times during the week is on Sunday morning before we begin when Ricky Childers has kids sing with our kids. Those of us that are adults are out there too, and they, they do a lot of Bible fact things. They do they sing some songs. And at the end, he always asks them some questions. He always asks them the same question to reinforce some really, really good things. And one of the questions he asks is, what is the best thing you can do in your life? Have you ever thought about that? There are a lot of things that are good. There are a lot of things that are better. But when you talk about the best, that's the ultimate. That's the utopia. And then he asks, what's the worst thing that you can do in your life? Wow, there's some bad things we can do. There's some worst things that we can do. But if you put the T on it, what is the worst thing that you can do in your life? They always get the answer right. The best thing that you can do and I can do in our lives is live our lives in such a way that we can go to heaven. The worst thing that we can do in our life is to live our life in such a way that we miss heaven. We miss a relationship, which is, doesn't matter what else good you do in your life, doesn't matter what else bad you do. You see, when we talk about following Jesus, that's the best thing that we can do. If we're not following Jesus, that's the worst thing that we can do. If we go to heaven, and live a life that will allow us to be there. That's the best thing that we can do. If we miss heaven, that's the worst thing that we can do. It's amazing sitting, listening to children on Sundays, how they get it right. And they do have it right. The best thing and the worst thing in life. Are you doing the best thing in your life?